Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel and in this video I'm going to tell you some of my tips and tricks how you can uh, manage your phone when you notice that some of your applications starting to crash uh, somehow and you understand that some of your application might close by itself or any other glitches with your application or just uh, just basic slowdown of your some of your application uh, installed on your phone. And in this video, I'm going to tell you some methods how you can uh, treat the situation. So before starting watching this video, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, hit the bell button to get notifications about my new videos and share with your friends. So let's go. So now actually everything that we'll need is already in our phone. So we don't need to install anything to go uh, on any service or anything like that. So uh, before just starting straight, we're going into our applications. And just uh, we need to uh, either just uh, use our search bar in order to find the application that we having problem with or just pressing on for example like um, I do sword by and etc so now I'm going to tell about my instance and uh, recently I had some problems with my YouTube so basically I opened it I used it a lot I would say for my whole life and uh, I I haven't have I haven't had any problems with it but recently I started notice that YouTube started working pretty weird so basically I open some video and this view just like jumps to in time I can watch it smoothly and then I found one trick that helped uh, help me in this situation so basically for example I can use any other application for this example so for example TikTok if you notice that your TikTok maybe or any other application this is just instance uh, if some applications start crashing or just working um, I would say unexpectedly slow you need to go straight into storage and here you will see uh, several uh, I would say par parameters. So basically, first one is application. So this is basically weight of your application. Next is data. It's basically your accounts, your settings, etc. And your cache. So basically, when I cleaned my cache, after this, my YouTube started working again like perfect. So I really suggest you, first of all, try to go into your settings and clear cache of any application that you have problems with and check your application after this after this action whether or not it started working well so i also wanted to mention why some applications might crash or might start working slowly so this all just goes into our memory so basically memory in our phones is just like uh, the amount of i would say data that allows some of our processes system processes work smoothly and just function correctly and uh, for example when you have too much applications on your phone this memory can quickly run out of space so basically uh, when you have too much applications too many applications in your phone this might uh, just take out too much of your memory in your phone and this could lead to your application some of your applications slow slow down or even crashing so i really suggest analyzing maybe you don't use uh, some applications anymore and i really suggest you just uh, delete them and if you need them back you can just download it download them again so let's go into another setting so basically if this uh, action first did not really help you you can try to reboot your phone so this uh, reboot rebooting your phone is basically second and very effective method if you have any problems with your applications you can try this method and uh, whether or not this method help you we're going to move forward so basically if this method help you that's great you can now uh, use your application but if this method also didn't uh, just didn't help you uh, I suggest you doing next so basically for example some of your applications might not work correctly just because you don't have the latest version of it so now we just need to go into our Play Store and press on your uh, account 
and go into manage apps and devices here as you can see update available so as you can see i have here some of the updates of my applications and as you can see i just need to for example press on this update button and after this this application might start working properly just because what is an update so update is when developers uh, I would say fix some common problems or maybe some of the users, um, I would say, put a complaint about some of the, I would say, bugs or anything like that, any other problems, and developers just fixed it and put uh, the actual update into Play Store for you to download and again, using your application smoothly and correctly. So I really suggest you doing this and the final method, if nothing actually worked, I suggested in the, I would say in the last, uh, in the most, I would say, uh, appropriate situation when you tried everything and nothing worked. So you just need to delete your application and try to download it again. This might really help you. So I hope that this video is really helpful for you. If you enjoyed watching it, please don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the bell button to get notifications about my new videos and share with your friends.